Well, hello from Paris, the city of light, and in this case, the city of sun. It's a perfect day for football at the Parc des Princes. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is this foot squad battles contest. Stuart, what are you expecting to see? Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And so the match is underway. Promising attack, this. But they dealt with the threat posed. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Kalidou Koulibaly plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Franck Yannick Kessier starts alongside Piotr Zielinski in central midfield. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. And space for the cross. Chance to finish. Marvellous anticipation. Cipria. De Bruyne. Now Cipria. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Grevich. Theo Hernandez now. Zielinski. He has time to play it over. Not away completely. Oh, it's in! And a goal on his debut, no less. What a way to endear yourself to the fans! Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Moving it forward. Has a go. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Now well, the short corner routine. And they'll get ready for the throw in. He's in with a chance. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Read it well. Well, attacking possibilities. Oh, wonderful bit of skill. Played into the center. Well, hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. Teo Hernandez. Ray Beach. And can he find someone at the far post? It's offside, unfortunately. Well, I understand he's eager to get on the end of the cross but he must stay on side. Teo Hernandez. And he takes on the shot. Just made sure nothing came of that.
Well, as you can see, the visitors have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes, and their passing patterns have created numerous chances. They surely must extend their lead soon. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance, and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So, back underway. One goal apiece here. And a decent position for Wolves to be in. Can he finish? And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes! Incredible stuff! Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. And space to cross it. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. And De Bruyne firing it over. And the no-nonsense clearance. And this situation could be dangerous. And it goes! Two goals in rapid-fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Well, it's a goal he's expecting to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Bremic. Moving the ball effectively. Bremic. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. De Bruyne. Well, they could run onto it here. Now Paul Pogba. Real chance. And a goal! What a magnificent display. It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. So continuing with the action, it's been all Wolves, and you sense they could meet out additional punishment. <laughs> Diallo. Cipriac. Well, they've given him too much space. Now well, just the tackle that was needed. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Pas de Pas. Into the second half here at the Pas de Pas. Oh, great defending. And he's lost custody of the ball here. In it goes! Such a complete performance for in front now. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Teo Hernandez, Kessier, Zielinski, Lozano, and caught by the keeper. And the referee says penalty. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. Oh, back of the net. And a debut goal to boot. It doesn't get much better than that.
Well, as you can see from the replay, the keeper tries to read the penalty, but he's sent the wrong way, and it ends up looking a very easy finish. Assegno la formazione ospite con il numero 7, Frank Kessy. Henry. Pogba has it. Cipria. Could cross it in here. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Good pressure high up the pitch. And a bad pass it was. Giovanni Di Lorenzo well not covering himself in glory defensively crossing into the middle a very effective clearance Zielinski Giovanni Di Lorenzo Kessier Rebic well an audacious effort not every player would try that type of thing. Cipria. Le signorine Alice Nezzi e Silvia Ciotto sono desiderate alla biglietteria dello stadio. Giving the ball away. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Well, an easy one to cut out, really. Really good attacking play. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Well, a top notch piece of defensive judgment. Disappointing for Wolves to give it away like that. Martinez. And showing fine vision. Is it going to be? Oh, it's in! And a goal on his debut, no less. What a way to endear yourself to the fans. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. And the danger's still on. Well, nothing comes of it. How can he take them on and beat them? Plenty of players waiting in the middle. He had work to do, the goalkeeper. Well, this game is almost in the history books, and it's not going to be one the visitors will want to remember for long, Stuart. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. Zielinski. Lozano now. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. This could pose problems for the defenders. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Zielinski going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Now Paul Pogba struggling to keep the ball. Martinez. Good visualisation and execution. 
pulls it back body in the way Martinez and the keeper did magnificently well that's just a wonderful save how did he stop that elects to go short Diaz Henry Gordon well when you can keep the ball like this it's got to be really annoying for the opposition Ibrahima Diallo Pedrinho Pogba applying vigorous pressure the referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order good looking ball chance here and there it is that will put the sail on mystery if there were any lingering doubts well he puts it away really well as you can see but you'd expect him to score from that range but they all count and that will be all for this game defeat for the visitors that's the big story you're absolutely right Derek while the result is